So, welcome. This is uh, Engelberg. Engelberg. Yeah. And uh, today uh, we have a, a day tour and we have a guide. What's your name? Jonas. Yeah, I have a company called Le Rit Mountain Bike Escape, specialized in putting together tours in various places in the Alps and elsewhere. And Engelberg is uh, one of those places. Uh, what is the plan for today? So today we're gonna head up to Brunnehitte. Uh, one of the sides uh, in the Engelberg Valley and then we're gonna um, ride down a trail uh, that takes us down uh, further down in the valley. Uh, it's one of the iconic rides here in Engelberg. Super nice, good views, good riding, long trail. And we end up in the valley and we can take the train back to Engelberg. Exactly. I read in the magazine of the hotel it's called Train Duro. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> I used. To I like that. <laughs> yeah, you use the trains a lot here in Switzerland because they're so efficient and it works really well to combine different valleys and uh, you kind of use it as a shuttle. Okay, well let's go then. Wait. So we just did a traverse and it was nice, um, rooty, rocky and with a lot of uh, exposed bits. You like that, right? Yeah, I loved it. Uh, <laughs> but it's quite good because in the beginning there were a lot of hikers, so uh, you missed the flow a bit. Thank you. Thank you. Hello. Okay. Have a nice day. Thank you. And here you don't find any hikers, so it's just uh, straight on. Technical, demanding, and full concentration, but it's really beautiful. Let's go. Let's go. These are definitely the uh, benefits of riding with a guide because he knows the place the best, which trails are good, which trails uh, aren't. He adapts to your skill level and he knows uh, all the sweet spots we like to ride, like this. Uh, it's amazing. You should definitely uh, check his website out. Uh, I'll link it under the video, of course. But uh, first, some more riding. We're not done yet. Let's go. Thank you. 
the first part is over. We took the train back to Engelberg. That's why it's called train duo. I like that word. So this is part two. Um, we took the same gondola up and now we are going to ride trails. Two trails. I think it's called Bruni 2. Pretty flowy but technical uh, as well. And then we're gonna link that with Burgli 2, which is a super fun local trail. So no pedaling up, just going down. Exactly. It's good for the afternoon. Okay, let's go. was part two um, now we have part three yeah. cheers guys cheers uh, we did a whole tour day with a lot of shooting we did indeed yeah yeah uh, it was really good and uh, we summed it up it's uh, a good mix between natural trails a, li a little bit steep a little bit tacky sometimes flowy for most of the times yeah but it's true it has a little bit of everything this yeah. place it's uh, like we spoke about, it's quite unknown, but uh, it's growing, uh, the biking scene here. And it's, yeah, uh, yeah mostly sort of natural <laughs> enduro trails, but a little bit of build trails yeah. as well. So. And you know this place very well. So you it's took really the shortcuts, so, <laughs> so we, didn't, uh, we uh, didn't miss anything. I mean, we ride these trails more or less every day, so we yeah. know them inside and out. And uh, that's why it's yeah so fun to show them out to you guys and uh, yeah show yep. what kind of trails we got out here there are a couple of trails on the map there's a official you can find them yourself but the all the other trails and there are a lot of trails uh, you can find with a guide uh, you save a lot of time yeah that's great and you know and if they're good exactly so you take the guesswork out of it if you have a guide obviously i'm promoting ourselves now but uh, yeah it's true it uh, saves a lot of time so uh, we'll leave a link uh, under the video of Thank course you. yeah and uh, if you like the video, give it a like, subscribe. Always give it a like. Yeah. <laughs> and uh, we'll see you on the next adventure. Ciao. Ciao. Oh. Avoiding the shit. <laughs>